Hey fellow team, what up? Welcome back to my channel, Grapes and Glitter TV. I'm your host, Revy Rose. Revy Rose, I'd like to say. And today's video is going to be about <laughs> newborns. <laughs> Obviously, we're still doing the mom series, so I have a couple more videos. Um, but today's video is all about what do you need for a newborn. So a lot of things you need. So for 2019, here are my top eight things that you need. So let's just jump right into the video. So my top eight thing that you need, obviously, is a travel system. So so we have uh, Nuna, Pippa, Car seat, which is made overseas. So I will do a video on both of these traveling sets, um, the car seat with Nuna, Pippa, and the stroller for Cybex Prium. So you guys can see how it works. It's super, super nice. And yes, it's definitely worth the buy. I feel super safe. Caden loves it. Um, we absolutely love the rose gold frame and when I say we get compliments everywhere we go in this stroller We get compliments everywhere we go in this stroller. So I ain't mad So definitely uh, watch my videos coming up if you guys want to see how those work. So Definitely get your travel system. It's a baby bag and I actually have His bag. So this is Kaden's bag. We actually have um, a Cybex one that we got with our Cybex stroller um, so it's kind of like an extra bag, but this one we really like to use. I recommend getting a backpack. You can just throw it over your shoulder when you're grabbing baby. You got a lot going on. This is definitely easy. It's an Eddie Bauer backpack. We got this from Bye Bye Baby. And definitely if you guys watched my last video, I told you they send me 20% off coupons every month. So sign up, get your Bye Bye Baby coupons because you can purchase some good stuff. So it has a lot of compartments. And one thing I really wanted with a bag was the side wipe. Because sometimes you just gotta grab a wipe. So super love this bag. I make it my purse when we go out. It is Caden's bag and I love it. Number six, zip onesies. So I have a couple of things. So one thing you're gonna really want a lot of, you've probably heard it before, but definitely some onesies. So here's my little baby. He's almost on a newborn, so I'm, I'm getting sad. But this is, um, you know, little long sleeves with the mittens. The buttons are what I'm really bringing this up for, so you can see the little... Okay. If you guys have ever... There you go. Here's the little buttons. Um, so you just button them in. Um, if you ever have watched a baby before, you know how crucial it is to get to those wet diapers. So that makes it really helpful. And I really love the little zip onesies. It keeps him all warm and snuggly. Everything he needs, his feet. So you're not running around trying to find little baby socks. So this is nice. Have plenty, plenty, plenty. I thought I had a few when I got my baby shower. And I still have some. Um, but you're definitely going to want a lot of them newborn especially because i didn't buy a whole lot of newborn clothes because i knew they were going to grow or he was going to grow fast that's what everyone told me uh but i kind of wish i had more newborn ones because the other ones were too large which now he's kind of getting into the three months and we're almost two months he is seven weeks um so for the first seven weeks you know i was scrambling trying to either put him on onesies that were too large or he didn't have as many in the newborn. So this was really helpful because sometimes you don't want to put them all in a whole outfit, especially before they get all of their shots. They will not be wanting to go or you do not need to take them out and about so much. So you want things that are comfy. That This is still <laughs> number six. So zip up onesies, onesies, but my changing table. So here's the photo of it. I love the drawers that I got, one of my mom's friends got this for me, or several of her friends actually pitched it and got this, got this for me, but I really, 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 really love it. Thanks, fam. Um, so it's like his dresser, pretty much. He keeps all his clothes. We keep his bath towels in there. There's a bottom drawer where his shoes go. So all of his stuff is tucked away and secure. So we have everything in his drawers, and when we're changing him, it's quick to go so in this photo you'll also see a diaper genie that is my number number five definitely get your diaper genie it is 
saving grace because dirty diapers stink and bef besides all that you just need a place to put them and not your kitchen garbage you know so it's um a nice little asset to put in your nursery right next to your changing table we use it um and it's really easy to change so you just take the little bag out there's a little razor in there tie a knot at the bottom and you got a new bag so really love it it keeps all the odor together and just all of his diapers in one place number four i call this b c p s all right this is what you need like for real for real hear me when i say this blankets pacifiers and burp cloths those are like an s i'll share what that is in a second but blankets, pacifiers, and burp cloths. You really, 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 really need those three things. Um, a lot of times, baby is just hungry. That's what they're gonna cry about most of the time. But sometimes they just really just wanna be cuddled with their blanket and swaddle. They just want something to suck on their pacifier. And of course, obviously the spit up. So you definitely need a burp cloth. So those three things are what I use day to day to day. That stands for sleep sack. So that's something we don't use every night, but it's really helpful like right now I'm shooting this video and it's the morning time and Kaden is with his pops. I definitely should get you one. This is pretty much what it looks like. Let's just take a look at it. So it's Velcro. You just Velcro them right in and their arms go in this spot and you zip them in and they're good to go. And what I love about the sleep sack more than anything is that it unzips at the bottom. So as he swaddled, it's kind of like a makeshift swaddle. As he swaddled in the middle of the night, if we need to do a middle night, middle of the night change, I can just unzip him here uh, and change him and he doesn't have to come loose. So that's really helpful. It keeps him nice and snug. And again, it's safe so he's not pulling his stuff all over. P B S. List for number three is bottles. So you guys really need bottles obviously if if you're nursing or not i'm nursing and also bottle feeding it's helpful when you want other people to help feed the baby so you make some bottles so whether it's breast milk or whether it's formula milk use a good brand of bottles i use phillips avent so i really really like their anti-colic bottles they're easy to clean it comes with a brush it comes with a pacifier the whole nine yard set um, yeah get you one of those and along with the bottles i haven't had the pleasure of using it yet but i've been told great things nursing scarf wear it like a cute scarf right so you can wear it like that baby <laughs> throw this little apron on and this comes down like so and now you can feed baby and there's a little mesh little area right here so you can look inside and you can see him but it gives you an ability to nurse in public let me pull it over one side and yeah next thing sling tub so here's a tub i have um it was on my registry from target i believe so this is super, super cute, super easy to use. Um, you'll need it to give him a bath and the sling really helps for newborns because their head's all wobbling all over the place. You're trying to wash their hair. Um, so it's just easier to you have the sling that can hold baby by themselves. And this is a grow with me tub so he can actually use it once he becomes a toddler. And the number one thing that I want to share with you guys that you super, 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 super need uh, for your newborn 2019 are boppies. Bop, 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 boppies. <laughs> Get you some boppies. <laughs> so here's a picture of my boppies. Um, I have the nursing boppy and I also have the newborn lounger and I have a swing. So boppies and swings is kind of what number one is. You These are things you want to have. <laughs> Now, granted, you'll want to hold your baby a lot of the time, but sometimes you need to put them down. Mommy needs some hands, so it is really helpful. The newborn lounger is really comfy while we're on the couch, and the nursing boppy is really helpful for those midnight feeds or feedings in general. Um, I just place it around me. I typically do the football hold, so I place it on my side, and 
voila, you have a table. So it's super helpful. Um, and the swing that we have, Ingenuity Dream Comfort. So it's the rock and cradle and it's super, super fun. Caden loves it so much. He has a mirror so he can look at himself. He gets a little light show. Um, his mobile's moving. I don't think it vibrates, but it does go up to like six different speeds. So he super loves it. And the chair can go sideways or it can go front. We'll so put him in there and he'll hang out in there for an hour and, and be super comfy so we can get some things accomplished before his next feeding. All right, <laughs> that's all we have today for Grips and Glitter TV. Remember, subscribe for more videos on beauty tips and mom hats. And yeah, let's be bosses. I'm a creative, 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 I'